Pushing the frontiers of medicine is nothing new to Dr. Ali Rizai. One of the world's leading neurosurgeons, Dr. Rizai holds the Stanley D. and Joan H. Ross Chair in Neuromodulation in the Department of Neurological Surgery. His specialty is deep brain stimulation, DBS, a procedure that involves placing tiny electrodes in the brain so that electrical charges can be used to relieve the symptoms of many conditions, much the same way a pacemaker is used to treat heart ailments. These are tiny implants, tiny microchips that are implanted in the brain and also the other parts of the nervous system to help patients who have severe Parkinson's, those who have severe chronic pain, migraines, headaches, or those that have other chronic disabling conditions like obsessive compulsive disorder, depression, and a number of other conditions to help improve their life. The groundbreaking surgery was developed in Europe about 20 years ago. Dr. Rezai trained with the pioneers of the surgery and has been performing DBS for 15 years. He has contributed to many advancements in the methods and equipment used for the procedure, which in the early days could take as long as 18 hours, but now can be done in as little as three. Dr. Rezai was being recruited by hospitals around the world when he decided to come to the Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center in 2009, a decision, he says, that took into account several factors. They basically said, whatever you need to do, we provide the resources for you to push the frontiers of medicine. And that atmosphere is prevalent everywhere in the medical center across the campus. So uh, I think it's a unique combination of having collaborators here who are excellent and outstanding in what they do, and this atmosphere uh, of innovation and pushing the frontiers forward, and these were very important for me. Performing an average of three DBS procedures a week at the Wexner Medical Center, Dr. Rezai has helped hundreds of patients. One of them is Don Townsend of Sylvania, Ohio. Don um, is uh, one of our patients who had a condition called uh, essential tremor, which is uh, shaking, and he was also a uh, art teacher and artist. And despite the best attempts at improving his tremor with medications, he became disabled and could not uh, be an artist anymore, could not be spending quality time with family and friends, and this tremor took over his life. And uh, the procedure has helped him to regain the quality of his life and be in control again. On, off. Yeah, Isn't his toes also there? Three on, where off. Watch his toes. Relax. On, yeah. off. As advanced as DBS surgery may be, and as miraculous as its results may seem, Dr. Rezai sees even greater benefits in the future. Uh, we are one of the top programs in the world with respect to deep brain stimulation and brain pacemakers, and we are also investigating a number of other conditions that we can help. We're doing clinical trials uh, that are FDA-approved trials, investigating the role of a brain pacemaker to help patients with severe traumatic brain injury, patients with severe obesity, patients with Alzheimer's. We're looking at patients with severe addictions, post-traumatic stress disorders, and also autism, and a number of other areas. So we're making great progress. I'm looking forward to doing more great things here with the broader community of Ohio State.